Hi everyone, my name is Izzy Indukwe and I am a third year student in the Epidemiology and Biostatistics program under the Bachelor of Medical Sciences program here at Western University in London, Ontario. So my program is really fun. I think the biggest pro of the reason why I chose it was because there's a lot of options. There's a lot of different specializations and modules that I can do for the program. So I was able to do either like an honor specialization in one subject area, or I could do a double major in multiple in two areas. So I really like the option and choices. A big con though is I am really bad at making decisions. So when it was time to actually pick my area of study, I was really indecisive, but I guess, you know, I guess that's a pro and con depending on your personality type. I found out about the program because I had a family friend who was in the program and she really liked it. So I started looking into it more and then that's why I chose it. The program's a lot of fun. You meet a lot of people because it is a really big program. I think when I was in grade 12, there was about 700 people that they were accepting and I was just really excited to meet a lot of different people. And honestly, that's how I met some of my closest friends. So the people in the program, there's a lot of different people People. Eventually you always find your crowd and your type of people, people who are like-minded like you and you have similar interests as well. So when I was in grade 12 and I was applying to the medical sciences program, I remember the only requirement was that they would look at my marks and I needed a minimum 90 average to get in across my top six. So they only look at that and no other special extracurriculars. For scholarships, I know that there's automatic entrance scholarships to Western. So when you meet that 90 average, there are tiers that you can get up for funding. And there's also other entrance and admission scholarships and bursaries. And I would suggest that you look at like the Western and register website for more information on that. So Western is a lot of fun, even outside of academics. So in my first year, I lived on residence and that's how I made a lot of my friends. It was really nice. I lived close to campus. I lived close to my classes. I also made friends through extracurriculars and through clubs. So in my first year, I was involved in the Black Student Association, the African Student Association, also this club called Women in STEM, and that was a lot of fun. So I guess I got to explore like different interests, so whether it was like my cultural interests or social interests or academic interests. Interest. It was a lot of fun and I also met upper years at LA too and also with finding mentors was a lot of fun to help further guide my undergraduate journey. Also Western has a little bit of a reputation of being a party school. I think that anything can be a party school is just depending on what crowd you fall in but the parties are a lot of fun at Western. I would say just to make sure you're responsible when you're partying and to keep your academics first but it's also good to let loose and unwind a couple of times and just have fun and to explore and to enjoy the journey at Western. So in high school, I would say if you're interested in this program, and especially just other life sciences program at any other university, I would suggest just looking at what they need. So usually they need chemistry, biology, math courses like advanced functions or calculus. Physics is usually optional. I would suggest at least taking grade 11 if you can, just so you can see the way of thinking because physics is a little different from anything I've ever seen before. But honestly, if you haven't done it in high school, it's totally doable to do it in university. For courses to take, I would say definitely take the mandatory ones. Make sure you have those ones in there. And the free electives, take things that you really enjoy, things that seem interesting. So in high school, I never took a psychology course and then I took one at university and it turned out to be one of my favorite courses. So again, just look at what you like and if you can, maybe get like little mini reviews from people who you know and I will say go from there. So my advice to my first year self is definitely to stay organized, stay on top of due dates so that later on, you know, if I knew that a fun event, if I knew a social was coming up, I was already prepared to go to it. I would say definitely don't deny yourself fun. I'd also say to take advantage of all the help that you get from the university. So again, if it's mental health resources, definitely seek those out once you realize you need them. I mean, even if it's academic resources, if you're struggling with a certain course, definitely going into office hour with a professor talking to your TA. We're also at Western, there is peer tutoring sessions. So definitely going out to that. Especially in your first year, there are so many resources thrown at you. Definitely take advantage of them.